Hello everyone, how are you doing? This is MD Tech here with another quick tutorial. In today's tutorial, I'm going to show you guys how to resolve if Microsoft Outlook is not responding, starting, or opening properly on your Windows computer. So this tutorial will apply for Windows 10 and Windows 11 computers. And without further ado, let's go ahead and jump right into it. So we're going to start off by opening up the search menu. Type in apps and features. Best match to come back with apps and features. Go ahead and open that up. On the right side in the apps list field, go ahead and type in Office. Best match to come back on Microsoft Office. Go ahead and select the three-dotted icon next to it and select the Modify option. If you receive the user account control prompt, you want to select Yes. It's going to ask how would you like to repair your Office programs. You want to select Quick Repair. It fixes most issues quickly without the need for an internet connection. And select the Repair option. It's going to ask ready to start a quick repair. This shouldn't take very long, but you won't be able to use your office programs until we're done. Select repair and then give this a couple minutes to run. Okay, so this is done repairing. We finished repairing your Office programs and features. You can now close this window and use your programs. Was it just closing out of here and then actually attempting to relaunch Outlook and see if your problem has been resolved? If you're still having an issue, you can come back into here and you would select the three-dotted icon next to Microsoft Office again. And you would select Modify and then Yes if you receive the User Account Control Prompt. This time we're going to select Online Repair fixes all issues but takes a little longer and requires an internet connection throughout. You can select this option if you are still having problems after a quick repair. Select the repair button. Ready to start an online repair. We'll download files to repair your installation. This may take some time and requires an internet connection. Go ahead and select repair and give us a couple minutes to run here. Okay, so once it's done, it should say you're all set, Office is installed now. What's it just closing out of here and then restarting your computer? And there you go, guys. Hopefully your Outlook issues have been resolved at this point. If you attempt to open up Outlook again, you should be able to sign in and you should be able to proceed with your normal activities. So pretty straightforward process here, guys. I do a buzz to help you out, and I do look forward to catching you all in the next tutorial. Goodbye.